Hi, welcome to We Play Golf. Today I'm going to show you and explain you how you can play an embedded ball in the rough over a bunker to the hole. Pretty difficult. Welcome back to We Play Golf. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe and see all our new videos. So as you can see, that ball is really nested into the grass. It's not really into the ground, but it's really deep in the nest. And the situation we have is, I've got like a 10 meter lob shot to be done and finish the ball close to the hole, but I got a water hazard behind it. So you make sure that you have enough loft. And the idea is, can you play this shot like you would play a bunker shot? So when I make this shot, I know that the club face is gonna stay open and feel that the bounce of the club will cut the grass underneath the ball. When you arrive at the ball, you should feel that the hands are very relaxed, very loose, so that the mass of the club can really bounce under the ball. As you bounce under the ball, the ball will go up and it will sit immediately, even if you're coming from the rough. You need to practice this shot quite a lot to have a, a, a very good idea of the speed you're gonna make and the amount of grass that you can take in your swing. It's a little bit like your bunker shot where you have to know the amount of sand you take. So when you play this shot, take the ball a little bit more towards your front foot so that you can place a club about two inch or five centimeter before the ball. So you have a lot of grass in between the club and the ball. You should not try to address the club closely behind the ball because then the ball could move. So you're placing the club before the ball, keep the club face slightly open. So you open the, sh the, the grip a little bit so that the club face will be open and you'll have more bounce just to make sure that it slides under the ball. So as the club is open and I've addressed the club face behind the ball, I now make a backswing which has a lot of wrist break to make that downswing steep and loose in the grass. Mind you, the follow through will be the same as a normal swing. You try to finish off towards your target. The ball will go very high because you take the grass underneath the ball. This is how we do it. Address, three quarter back, release a clip in the grass. So next time when you're unlucky and you find your ball back embedded in the rough, you got to pitch it over the green, you know what to do. And hope you enjoy this video. See you next time. <laughs>